at Bellevue Police and MUD are not laughing about tonight. Early this morning, somebody opened a fire hydrant that spilled water for nearly an hour while it was too below outside. Reporter Joe Kadat is live with the mess. Joe. Just before 5 this morning, Bellevue Police found a fire hydrant spilling thousands of gallons of water near 17th and Hogantown, casting a sheet of ice across the street. Bellevue police took this video and are looking for those responsible for a prank that could have created an extremely dangerous situation. You have to understand that this is a public safety device. It's there to fight a fire. It's there for a purpose to protect the neighborhood. Gene Sidek oversees the area's 26,000 fire hydrants. The hydrant can freeze. Uh, that, hi that hydrant can be frozen solid. And obviously when it's frozen solid, the fire department can't operate it for a fire. The hydrant spilled about 1,500 gallons per minute and took nearly an hour to shut off. The first danger obviously is the ice that forms and the traffic ha hazards that form from a hydrant that's operated this in, uh, unoperated in an authorized sense in this type of weather. While the sheets of ice that were sprayed from the hydrant didn't hurt anyone, this Bellevue police officer says it could have been a disaster. It could cause pipes to burst uh, uh, under the city it, it, or under the streets. It could also uh, cause flooding in other people's basements, uh, get uh, children living uh, in a bed, uh, basement bedroom or elderly um, could very easily endanger their safety as well. Officer Griner has a message for those responsible. Think twice next time before doing something like this and understand that uh, we're looking for you and we're going to find you. MUD says leaking hydrants can be disastrous, especially in extreme cold temperatures. They encourage anyone who sees a faulty fire hydrant to call their emergency number. That number is available 24 hours a day and is online at KMTV.com. Reporting live, Joe Kadant, KMTV Action 3 News.